Bishop in Columbus, Ohio, and uh, I just wanted to pause at the end of a very busy day to wish you a very happy birthday. Uh, I understand from your daughter and your son-in-law, who are faithful members of our congregation, that you're celebrating a major monumental milestone. To live to be 90 is a wonderful gift from God. 
and you've been blessed not only with longevity, but you have been blessed over the course of your life to make many accomplishments, to realize many dreams and goals achieved and accomplished. The lives that you've touched, the bishops, the pastors, the ministers, the lay people that you have had influence over, that you've ministered to, is indeed a stellar and sterling record. You can look back on nine decades of fruitful, positive, productive living. The kingdom is better because of you. So know that wife, the family, and First Church here in Columbus celebrate with you. Have a blessed, happy, tremendously exciting birthday. And may God continue to bless you. Be blessed, Mother. Hey, Nana, it's Andrea. I just wanted to wish you a happy birthday. Mommy wanted us to stop and give you one of our favorite memories with you. And so one of mine would definitely have to be going up to DC and seeing you. And um, as soon as we would walk in the house, you have that poster hanging up of me and Veronica when we were really little, maybe like one and two. That's my first memory. And then of course, food. You always cooked a lot for us. We always had food. But I remember you were the first and probably the only person to put bananas in our cereal. <laughs> and so I remember breakfast, if you had cereal with bananas, she always cut up the bananas and put it in there. And then also when you would come down to Texas and you would stay with us, I can remember you waking us up early in the morning, super early in the morning. But you would get us up so we can pray and have Bible study. And I love you for that. I've always loved you for that. I love you for who you are. I want you to have an excellent birthday. I'm glad we're celebrating you because you totally deserve it. You're totally worth it. We love you. Franklin loves you. Lily loves you. We send our love. We can't wait to get up there and see you guys again. All right, take care. Bye. Happy birthday, Nana! We love you. Love you. Veronica, Paul, Genesis, PJ, Preston. Pa Parker's not here. I need but to see it. What are you doing now? Tell her happy birthday. Happy birthday, Nana. Happy birthday, Nana. I love you. Aww. Aww. Oh, he's kissing you. He's not that innocent. Don't let him see you. Not at all. Hope y'all are having fun. Talk to y'all later. Bye. 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 Hi, Nana. Um, happy birthday. I just wanted to say I love you very much. And I hope that today and this year is the best one of your entire life. I hope that God puts so much favor on you that you don't have enough room to receive it. And that you just enjoy this day. Um, with all your family. I'm sorry I couldn't be there, but I hope you get this message and know that I love you very much. And um, just have a great day. Um, sending lots of love your way, okay? Mwah. Praise the Lord. I got you going. Mother Quinn, Sister Martin, can you hear me? Oh, and praise the Lord to everyone who's downstairs. I'm Sister Gladys Martin, the young man who just came down, Brother Floyd Martin. And oh, I am so glad to be here. Sister Quinn, even though we won't see each other's face right now, it's just so many things that I could say about you and a few I'm going to say because you know that we have known each other for, oh, I guess something like, we've been in the church together for, I believe, something like 50 years together, and so many things we did together. Oh, and those of you who don't know some of the things that um, Dr. Quinn did, Dr. Quinn was on the radio. She had a 8.30 on Sunday morning. I had a 8.30 uh, Sunday morning um, 
service that she would do for a pastor by the name of Pastor Reed, and we would go sometimes. And oh, there was a lady on the radio, the name of the song Pastor Lucille Banks Robinson. Robinson. Oh, and just so many places. Mm -hmm. Sister Quinn took some of us at church, mm -hmm. and we learned so much, and we just enjoyed it so much. Mm -hmm. And we remember Sister Tammy it was the baby, and I, I had two sons, mm -hmm. and they would be all together mm -hmm. playing. Mm -hmm. And uh, Mother Quinn was, and I'm not saying this because of who's here, mm -hmm. but Dr. Quinn was one of the nicest mm -hmm. people that you could find mm -hmm. anywhere. Mm -hmm. She was so loving, mm -hmm. so loving. And I could keep just going on and on and on, mm -hmm. but my pastor wanted me to let Sister Quinn know mm -hmm. that he wants to wish her a happy birthday. Mm -hmm. He wished that he could have come, mm -hmm. but his wife is, is very sick, so mm -hmm. he don't get to go many places. Mm -hmm. But he said, happy birthday, he loves you, mm -hmm. and keep looking up. Mm -hmm. Oh, I just love you all so much. Mm -hmm. Sharon, thank you, thank you, thank you for insisting. You just got to come, Gladys. I said, Sharon, my leg. But who won? Mm -hmm. Sharon or Gladys? <laughs> Sharon, you won. Mm -hmm. Th I thank the Lord, everyone. Mm -hmm. I just thank the Lord for Dr. Quinn's 90th birthday. God is good. God is so good. Sister Quinn, I love you. Although we won't see each other's faces, you know I love you or else I wouldn't come over here and not see your face. Mm -hmm. God bless everyone. Thank you. Okay, it's up rolling. Hello, how are you doing? Hi, Mary Louise. Um, we are so happy that we are able to get together and uh, wish you a very merry ninth year, year birthday. Uh, this is my son, Duke, his son, Amari, his son, Tristan, his daughter, Trinity, that's my daughter, Estina, her <laughs> daughter, and her daughter's daughter. So, big family here. Uh, we want to uh, send you a special birthday present. Ready? All together. Happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, happy birthday Mary Louise, happy birthday to you, and may you have many more. Merry Christmas Mother, too. We love you and Merry Christmas, thank you. Happy birthday! Congratulations! What a milestone! It's, you are a phenomenal woman. Quinn, you were one of the first, Dr. Quinn, you were one of the first people that I met when I came to Washington, D.C. You embraced me and you taught me. I mean, there were so many things that I can say about you. I just don't know where to begin. I cherish our friendship. We'll renew you years before, but I just cherish the time and the friendship and the blessing just knowing um, you as a woman of God. Uh, the Council of Women Ministers, you have encouraged me on this journey. I know that as a minister, it is not one of our choosing, but you showed me that God's way is the best way. And I just thank you for all that you have meant to me in my life. God bless you. Happy birthday. Wilbur and I love you. Here's Wilbur. <laughs> Gee, what a wonderful, wonderful occasion. We're just so blessed this day. 
this shit will do your 90th birthday. Oh, it's not quick. As I reminisce, I think of how many times we've traveled. One time we were traveling every night.